Hello and welcome to my first look at a Horace Heresy novel, Luther, First of the Fallen. It will set you back £12.99 from Games Workshop. You will be able to get hold of it cheaper from uh, other dedicated bookstores and third party sellers. Um, I always like to do these first looks, even though I haven't read the novel and it's not a full review or anything like that. Um, I like to give you an idea of, of what you're getting um, for, for your money, as always. So um, what you are getting for this £13 is a hardback book that's um, exactly the same format as the, uh, the Primark books. Um, and, um, you know, I like that. I welcome that. It's definitely in the same vein as those and like, uh, you know, Valdor and things. Uh, your number of pages that you're going to get with this book is 211. So it's not a huge, huge book, um, but 211 pages, that's all right. It's written by Gav Thorpe, uh, synonymous to the 40K and Horace Heresy uh, uh, novels. And here are a few of the other books that they recommend uh, you picking up. Um, it was first published in 2020. Uh, so last year doesn't have any artwork in there whatsoever um, it is just a straight up novel um, but the front cover and the green is is absolutely gorgeous isn't it um, and you know it's mirrored on the the spine of the book as well uh, let me just read you the preface knight of the angelicaster savior of the lion grand master of the order Lord of the Dark Angels, Protector of Caliban, Chaos Heretic, Destroyer of Caliban, Sorcerer of the Abyss, Arch Traitor, Dark Oracle, First of the Fallen. Can one man be all of these things? Kept alive and imprisoned for 10,000 years, Luther is the curse and the salvation of the Dark Angels made manifest. None are so close to the heart and history of the chapter as the man that embodies all that was great about the First Legion and all that is shameful about the Dark Angels. In his story is writ the tale of the Horus heresy in a single long life. Glory, honour, pride, shame and betrayal weave a tapestry of truth and lies that the supreme grandmasters of the Dark Angels have sought to understand and unravel across ten bloody millennia. Luther claims repentance for his past deeds, but it was his sins that condemned the chapter to its secretive fate, or should warnings from history have been more closely heeded. So there you go. Uh, that is... Luther, first of the four. I can't wait to read this. Um, you know, I've built uh, Lionel Johnson the Primark recently, and I have to say I have been eyeing myself up some of the uh, Horus Heresy um, Dark Angels offerings from Forge World. What do you guys think of this novel? Uh, obviously, I don't need to say keep it spoiler free, um, but if you think it was a good read, you know, um, it'd be great to hear your feedback. And which other Dark Angels uh, novels do you recommend? It'd be great if you could share that with this uh, YouTube community. Thank you ever so much for joining me today. Thank you for watching The Emperor Protects.